Hey everyone, it's Ryzen. And Liz. Welcome back to Let's Play Eternal Sonata. Well, I'm using the same party as before, same setup. You could sub out Falsetto for Polka if you want the extra healing, if you're having difficulty somehow. I guess you could give her a power ring or something. I don't know. Uh, maybe a power ring and a bubbly hat I'd probably give her. But, uh, yeah, yeah, same as before. Uh, the only thing is, don't start a Harmony Chain with the Verbum Celebrus attack, because I only have one ability. <laughs> so if I did that, that would not be good. I would not be able to continue the chain. But her Dark Move is fair game, because she's got Lineage Devant. And item setup is just uh, Angel Trumpets. No status elements this time. If I can find Controllers them. are good. They should be, unless your controller turned off. Nope. Oh, really, game? Yeah, it's this guy. Palette Swap. Uh, he's got Violent Death, which is the four-hit slashing I AoE. I see where he's going. I don't know. Instant Timing, but the timing window's tight. Red Squirrel is the three-hit melee AoE with delayed timing. Wait for his weapons to cross first. Furrow is the three-hit lashes with his tail that How targets characters behind the boss. It's an AoE. Instant creatures. Timing. And Heavy Stop is the melee stop attack. Uh, it can miss, though, if they're too close to him, so that's good. Uh, timing's slightly delayed on that. He'll lift his foot up. Uh, that's when you'd want to time the block. It's unfortunate you didn't get this thing. But pretty much the same strategy. Obviously, if I had Phantom Pain, I'd use that, but, well. You tell him, uh, Predator. Awesome. Go ahead and, uh, see if I can get... There we go. It's not quite in, uh, what do you call it? Uh, infinite range, but pretty close. You didn't block that. That was on you. I didn't even realize that. You didn't even react. That's wonderful. And the frame rate crashed. Of course it did. My answer! Haha! <laughs> I love that. Should be able to do a little bit of healing here. There we go, get a Verbo Mixfellow. Yeah, he'll die really, really fast. I'm surprised he's still alive. I mean, I guess you could poison him or something if you really cared, but... I mean, now that you got so many Harmony Chains... I don't see the point. Anything to get you my way is going I mean, between down. Falsetto and Frederick causing harmony chains, you are going to just absolutely demolish this poor guy. Yep, he's certainly dead. You got him. He's, he's, de he's not dead? Oh, he's dead. I had to whack him once. <laughs> uh, he drops Tears right arm. It's completely useless. It's worse than the left arm, uh, except it's got a little bit of uh, attack power. And for defeating him, just as I planned, Frederick picks up Phantom Pain. Uh, one of, if not the best ability in the game. Uh, You'll see one why. of Serenades comes close, but yeah, Phantom Pain is ridiculous. It was actually buffed from the 360 version. I will protect Prince Crescendo. Uh, because in the 360 version, I think it was bugged. In that it lower or no, it, it raised the enemy's attack power per hit, which doesn't make any sense. Yeah, raised the attack power of your enemy. Uh, but now it lowers defense per hit. It's ridiculous. And it hits like four times, so each hit lowers defense. Why is it so cold already? I don't know. It's only September! And now we get some viola. Hey guys, I got a question. I got an answer. Uh, yes? Um, yes? It's been bugging me for a while now. Why do you two have to look so depressed all the time? They're terminally ill! I mean, we're on our way to tangle with Count Waltz. Your mopey faces are just gonna bring down morale. What? Oh, I'm sorry. That's it. That's the face. <sighs> Allegretto's never gonna be able to concentrate on fighting because he'll be too busy worrying about you. Okay. Viola, be serious. 
<laughs> there you go. Good girl. That's more like it. If you say so, now, Viola. what are we gonna do about you? What in the world are you thinking about all the time that gives you such a gloomy expression? Yeah, he's dying in bed in Paris. Well, if you really must know. And that he's God. Just now, I was wondering. I, I what guess he is. My existence within this imaginary world, once the dream I'm having comes to an end. I don't know. You tell me, Frederick. Oh, brother, what are you talking about? When you wake up from a dream, you just open your eyes and start a new day. You should spend more time thinking about what you're going to do in reality, not in dreams. I mean, there's a ton of stuff that needs to get done. Like, what about what do you have to do? Shear your so sheep? Reality is <laughs> she gave them away, remember? She released them. Oh, yeah, then what do you have to do, Viola? You have nothing. nothing. If it's a dream that you really don't want to forget about, what you have to do? Write it down Grow some crops or something? Up, right? I don't know. And you're a composer, so you could even put it to music. Yeah, he'll get right on that. The music of an unforgettable dream. Think about it, Frederick. Wouldn't that be wonderful? Alright, so are we clear on this moping thing? Don't go trying to keep all your problems to yourselves. That's what friends are for. Let us help, okay? I like how everybody just disappears during these scenes, <laughs> other than the people talking. Frederick, I've decided something. I'm not gonna give up. I want to be able to treasure the memory of all this. This adventure we've had together. You're right. There's no denying that the time we've shared together has been real. As I squint. I can't believe somebody actually pointed that out. Now I can't stop noticing it. Now we got a lot more darkness. And a lot of sand. Which... You would think would be a problem for Frederick, but as you recall, we have ways around that. <laughs> but anyway, I'm going to be switching my party now, so uh, to Again. a different party. So I'll be back. All right, I'm back, and uh, I'm using Frederick, Serenade, and Beat for the second uh, set here. Now that I've got Polka to learn um, Blossom Shower, I don't care about her. Uh, I want to use her for the, uh, well, for Waltz, obviously. <laughs> to mitigate his BS this time. Um, but now that she's got that, I don't care. I'd like to get Zodiac for her, but I'm not even going to use um, Dark Moves in that fight, so I don't care. Let's go. But yeah, for Frederick, I got the Werewolf Choker, Brilliant Brooch. He needs that so that he can use Phantom Pain. So you can see the ridiculousness that is impending. Dual Power Rings on Serenade. And Beat. Because he's got the Cerberus Canine, I gave him the Bubbly Hat to sort of help his speed even more. Storm Shroud to give him more movement speed, and the Crimson Brooch to uh, really kick some ass. Did and anybody get any new moves? I don't think so. Uh, Vital Drain uh, will be his source of healing. Obviously, Fire Blast is the way to go for the most part, but use Vital Drain if you need healing. I doubt it. I could check, but I don't think so. Oh, she got, she iron, got cross. iron Cross, which I don't remember if I want to use that. I don't think so. Uh, iron Cross is the same as Grand Slam, but it is significantly stronger. Uh, it's actually stronger than Deadly Orbit, but you don't build the Echoes that Deadly Orbit does, and Salsa's an, an, an Echo Builder, so I will probably show it off in the post game, but not right now. Night Arrow, yeah. Oh, she did. She got Night Arrow. Uh, that's the healing version of. Well, it's, it's the dark version of Heal Arrow. Except it only heals two people. It does. It works like Earth Heal does. Except it's stronger than, um... Light Arrow. Or Heal Arrow, as it's called. Where are we going now? Back to the bottom. Oh, because now we gotta go to the bottom part, Yes, right? we have to go to the... Uh, no, we have to go to the other tower. Oh. But first we can fight some guys. I just have to run away, right? Kind of. You don't need to run away. But her thing works better from far away. No, it doesn't. It doesn't matter. No. She's not like me. No, it was pretty good. <laughs> oh god, beat is still amazing. All right, CD it's time. Amazing. Phantom pain. You got him, Frederick. He's he's dead. He's dead. Doesn't he have a really awesome quote he says with that? Something like that. 
Well, you know it's it's referencing like phantom limb pain, right? Yeah. Yeah, I just wanted to show. You know what? Screw it. I like annihilating my enemies. What a fool. Burbo McSpello. Yeah, with that Storm Shroud, B can get into position really easy. <laughs> oh, I love it. Oh, God. It didn't kill him, though, but that was funny. That was not nice, sir. That was pretty good. Yeah, you do lose a little bit of damage, I think. Where with, are you? Um, you? Oh, Don't you guys go that way? Yeah. I, I think the flint picklock is a little bit stronger because of the extra crits, but it's negligible, and I'd rather have the speed bonus. You know, game, I'm really tired of fighting Uparts and Onions all the time. Oh, this is what you're fighting for the rest of the game, so... So, I'd rather fight the guys that go, Whoa! You can't. They don't exist. I like them, though. Yeah, They're well, my there's favorites. no more of them until the post-game. I like them, though. They're funny. Uh-huh. I'm sure they are. I believe I gotta go this way. Whoops, I guess we're fighting this guy. You foolish creatures. Man, her echo building is just beyond sad. Excuse me. Excuse me while I use this. Yeah. <laughs> so even if they somehow survive it, their defense is going to be lowered. If it gets stronger as you use it. I have no idea why it would increase the attack power of your enemies in the 360 version, but whatever. Is everyone unharmed? I don't know if that was a bug or what. Not good. We're on the third floor now, I think. Yeah, because these guys are on the lower floors. Yeah, this is a safe point. Probably get to the next guy. Um, we'll probably get to Waltz this time, but we're not going to take him on. So, based on that, there would great. You fool there would probably be two episodes. Maybe I could squeeze in a bonus episode for well, the kind of extra ending, but I don't know. Soulless monster. Oops. Spirits pathway. I wanted to heal. Don't have blossom shower, so I gotta be a little more careful here. Nice camera angle there. Wow, we didn't even hit this. My God, he is strong. Not as strong as Frederick, but points are trying. I guess I gotta go this way. So, essentially, we need to activate the sand from the other tower now. Uh, if you headed to the basement floor, you would notice that it's like a dead end, and that's because you need sand down there. So I guess that's how you're supposed to know what you're supposed to do, but... I don't even know what's down there. That's where you're supposed to go at the end. Oh. Do you remember? No. 
Uh, that's where Walt is. Alright, let's start the East Tower now. Eh, we'll probably just take this guy on and end it, and then How next time we'll do the East Tower. You're never gonna get a second one off. Spirit's pathway. The fart on you. Yeah, if you're too far, sometimes that. Did that just hit air? <laughs> damaged him again. You know, he already died. Okay, yeah, we're gonna stop here. Uh, next time we'll do the East Tower. We should be able to make it through the end of the East Tower, I think, but. Yeah, we'll go from there. This is Ryzen. Endless. Thanks for watching. Take care.